to take that next level. We, we've lost some coaches that have uh, gotten promotions, gone on to uh, you know things that really kind of fit their future a little bit uh, better. But it was a, it, it gave us an opportunity to uh, bring in some good football coaches. We talked about some of our earlier additions to our staff, and uh, now our staff is complete for the most part. Adding uh, first off, Bob McLean. Uh, Bob is is always good in your program. We have guys around and and that are in position to. Uh, it's an easy transition. And in Bob's case, of course, he has a history with Rod and just in our program. It's an easy decision. Of course, with every position, we look around and talk to people, but it's an easy decision to move Bob up. We're really excited about what he'll bring uh, to the offensive line room. Uh, has a history, has been around in a long period of time, a lot of good programs. Um, so we're excited about Bob moving up a guy on our staff. Um, to have an opportunity to bring back uh, two guys. First, I mean, Mike Bell and you know Mike is you know a great player for us. Uh, you know he's been a great coach in the past for us, and uh, it's always someone, of course, that uh, I've you know looked to. And uh, situation has allowed itself to try to get Mike back, but uh, this time that was the case. So we're excited about what Mike will bring to the football field as a coach. You know, great teacher as is Bob. Um, there's a recruiter too, and again, when you know the university the way he does, is really excited about Mike coming back home and bringing his family back to Champaign. And the same thing with Lou and Nanny Dad. Um, you know, when you have an opportunity to bring in, you know, your, your strength and conditioning coordinator spends as much time with the team as anyone, the strength department. Lou has a history, and uh, once the position became open, um, if I can only tell you how many people reached out to me uh, that love the University of Illinois that wanted to see him back, but you take that into consideration. But we, I, we were just looking for the best guy to lead our program, and we got a chance to meet Lou, and of course, uh, it was an easy fit for us. So, really excited about both of those guys, and of course, Bob, you know, moving up on our staff. Take Coach. a question. Coach Lou had so much support from all these former players. How much did that play into this and maybe give you comfort knowing that this guy is renowned and loved by all these former guys? I mean, it helps, you know, an awful lot when, you know, you have a history here and, and people love you. Um, but at the same time, I mean, it's if no one did, if no one knew him, uh, that's who I would have hired. So, uh, but it's always good when other people can confirm uh, what you're thinking. But uh, again, that was an easy choice. Yeah. Well, some of the recruits that you guys have got family atmosphere here. How important is the continent to bring somebody like Bob from within and bring familiar faces back just to kind of keep them you know, uh, Very important. And uh, when you've been around like Bob has, and uh, he knows the offense as well as anyone, and guys got a chance to see Bob, the man, to uh, be, just be around him. But that is good. Uh, we were looking for a guy that we thought could, you know, we just know our program is headed in a, in a direction that we're really excited about. And a part of that has to be our offensive line play. And really just think that Bob can help those guys keep taking steps and uh, you know, did some good things last year. We're going to do better things this year. Coach didn't decide to retain Mike before, but he's bringing him back now. Which, what have you seen change about him since the end of now? Well, I don't know much about retaining. What I did is, I came in with coaches that I knew, and I looked at everybody right then. Uh, I never get into retaining guys just based on that. And the situation didn't allow itself for, for Mike to come on our staff then. This time we had an opening. That was the case, and we're really excited about that. What did he add in recruiting, especially in this state?